Design Slam is always a lot of fun. They've got a lot of uh, creative people using amazing tools, and it's always fun to watch uh, what they can do in 20 minutes. I feel it's really interesting to see meshes, sub-D meshes in AutoCAD right now. That's completely new technology, and first time I see that in AutoCAD. I'm updating my uh, Facebook, talking about the Design Slam and how these guys are kicking They're great, huh? 20 minutes. It's amazing. It's just mind-boggling how good they are. I saw it last year, a lot of energy around it, a lot of fun. Can't wait to see the end this year. Pretty amazing. I don't think I've, there's no way I could keep up with them, so. So, they've done a lot in the last, what, 15 minutes. Who do you think is the best design so far? Um, I don't know. I'd probably have to go with the third guy. Third guy? It's, it is amazing. These guys are definitely professionals what they can turn out in a little bit of time. I used to teach this program when I worked for a reseller a couple years ago and they're doing some things now that you couldn't do back then and I'm not even sure how they're doing it so. Well it's pretty interesting I think the uh, the DJ helps as far as giving a good ambiance. Who do you think is winning so far? Uh, I'd say the guy on the right over there so uh, yeah it's looking pretty good. I think the forms in the uh, I think it's Rodrigo in the center there he's it's got something pretty interesting going on, so. Uh, I'm impressed. I don't think I could quite manipulate things this quickly in front of a room full of people. I must say that I'm uh, really impressed. Uh, all three of them are uh, seem to be really interesting. I'm uh, curious to find out a little bit more about their thought process. Uh, really impressed. I think this has come so far since, you know, early stages of AutoCAD 3D at least. I think it rivals any 3D application right now, if you know what you're doing, of course. So are you going to be a participant next year? Oh, absolutely. Uh, no, I don't know if I can keep up with these kind of guys. They look pretty impressive to me. Did you know you could do 3D like this in AutoCAD? I knew. I knew. I just, I know that you can do much more now in 2010, so. We are here with the three contestants, Ged, Axel, and the winner, Rodrigo, so just let me know what, what, what does it feel to be in the stage in 20 minutes doing all the stuff that we're doing. Get. Oh god, it's, it's harrowing, but it's still a lot of fun though. I mean, you can feel like your sweaty palms kind of trying to, while you're trying to move the mouse and trying to remember what it is you're trying to draw there, but uh, it's still just an incredible rush to kind of do that and kind of see what, how things shape up. I, I thought the, the table was moving because of the bass, but then I realized it was my hand that was moving and not the What's tail. I was shaking, I was shaking. I made some mistake, but still, finish. finish yeah, 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 yeah. So I'm really happy to have done it, yeah. So, had fun? Yeah, it was a fantastic experience, yeah. Amazing. So, how does it feel to be the greatest AutoCAD user of the year? <laughs> <laughs> it's awesome, really, it's, it's awesome. Uh, the past four weeks been such a crush, and I think I was having one of my clients in the back asking me to, <laughs> to finish the render uh, really fast, so it was really, really this adrenaline uh, going out, and it was incredible, incredible. So, would you do this again? Uh, no. Sure, yeah. anytime. Yeah, let's, let's, let's do it again. Let's go back. Let's go back now. Come on, come on, come on. Three workstations yeah. there. Let's do it again. Absolutely. So, thank you very much, guys, and thank you all.